I came on this expedition to research microplastics. We see it on the beaches and in the water, but we really don't know how many microplastics um, are in the coral sea. Walking along here, you see some really old trash, and all of, a lot of it's photodegraded. You go to pick it up and it just shatters, and that's in, almost instant microplastics. So I'm feeling a little overwhelmed by the quantity of trash <laughs> on this beach, um, I don't even know where to begin. I mean, you can't even start to think about cleaning this sort of thing up as an individual. Uh, Indonesia is one of the largest uh, countries that are releasing plastic waste into the ocean, and it is a matter that needs to be addressed uh, immediately, right away, because the, the impact to the marine environment is, is immense and uh, if we don't stop it now then it might be too late. Plastic is affecting the health of thousands of marine species. At the surface of the ocean where photosynthesis is occurring, this accumulation of uh, microplastics is being ingested by the largest of the filter feeders right the way down to the smaller organisms, the microorganisms at the bottom of the food chain. We're ready to go. So we're rinsed and we are going to start the trawl. I'm recording the lat and long of this sample because once we process the sample, we then post those results on the map. And so people from all around the world can see what the plastic concentrations are in their local watershed. The initial studies looking at microplastic ingestion in fish have shown behavioral growth genetic issues with fish that have ingested microplastic in the juvenile stages. So we know that there's some negative impacts, we just don't understand the full extent. How widespread is microplastic ingestion going to be affecting the future of basically every animal on this planet? Uh, we are a part of the natural environment and if we are not protecting those things, then we are putting everything on the planet at risk. Plastic is entering the oceans at an alarming rate, you know, 80 million tons a year um, approximately, and all of that plastic will eventually become microplastic. Even if we stop producing plastic tomorrow, we would still have this legacy for centuries to come of microplastics in the ocean.